I am Angel Superstar from Los Angeles, California. I'm a hair and makeup artist with over 30 years experience. Ooh. And I have a hair and makeup line and the makeup line is called Beat Snap Fierce. I'm an 80s child so I grew up at the height of the MTV period and so I grew up on videos and who did this hair, who did the makeup and then when the 90s came around I became one of those people. And so here I am now with uh, Beat Snap Fierce and I'm speaking into existence as we all should that Beat Snap Fierce is a global brand. A lot of makeup artists when they tend to do somebody's face they say ooh honey your face is beat and they start snapping right so beat snap and then when you get finished you look so fierce so it's a cross between the glamorous side as well as being totally outrageous fun free and having a lot of color my mother was from um, Houston Texas and my dad is from La Romana Dominican Republic <laughs> so let's just say um, there's a little bit of southern and there's a little bit of Caribbean going on and with those two people coming together making one really eccentric child I like color my dad is a painter and a singer and my mom was a jazz musician see when I was growing up my mother being southern southern from Texas and my dad being uh, a brown Dominican and then when you start you know they, they see me in this child with all this hair all of this hair oh my goodness they will see him start talking Spanish <laughs> and they see my mom and then they see the child and they say well what 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 love happens everywhere heck yeah oh my goodness that's uh, that's sometimes that's the hardest thing to really accept being accepting of who you are, it's not even the outside people making fun of you because I have been teased a lot, but it's accepting that you are brilliant and that you are talented talented and gifted and you have things to share with people. Accepting self-love self and acceptance is the most important thing. During the time when I came up, they used to always make the black girls look so ridiculous. The, the foundation was always a mess. The hair was always like subpar and I decided to become a, a makeup artist because of this I decided to become a makeup artist because I wanted to see the make the the models look good as well as the clothes so when you talk about putting everything under one roof that's what I've done makeup art beauty fashion life adding more to the brand adding more lines to the brand you know, such as the lashes, the foundations, the eyeshadows, and kind of interpreting that with my art because as you guys know that I am a visual artist, art by superstar, and so I want to I want to teach more. I want to show women how to be beautiful from the comfort of their home, where they don't feel intimidated, where somebody has a larger skill set than they may have. Um, I think we're we're moving in a, a age of information right now. And so with that, people want to know how to put on the, the right shade of lipstick. They want to know their best foundation. They want the information that was so much hidden from them, like it was such a big secret. Now, with um, social media, everything now is in the open. And I want to be a part of that technology. Never give up. Get out your own head, get out your own way. Aside from letting people talk crazy to you and talk negative about what you're doing, you got to get out. You have to get out your own head and be the best brand that you can be. You are always the brand. Every time you step out the door, every time you make a post, every time you pass out a card, every time that you put something out there, you are the brand. And don't give up because there will come, there will come times where you'll feel like you're all by yourself. You'll feel like you can't do what you need to do and you have to refocus and tell yourself that you, that your stuff, that your brand, everything about you matters. <laughs>